What's up, guys? Welcome back. It's Andy here with the Velo Games Femmes 2022 Tour de France preview. Um, it's a pretty big race, and I'm gonna tell you who are good riders, who are not, about the course, and yeah, that's about it. So, starting off in this, we have 26 credits for Anamik Van Vluchen. Not actually bad value, though most would think it is. Um, she's looked really good this year. Um, Demi Valdering for 22 is a great deal, but I think Van Vluten will probably win, but I feel like Valdering is safe for a second. Um, Cavalli looks like she could podium, same as Borghini. Um, who else is there? Niwan Domo, but she doesn't look too good. Um, but first I'm going to tell you guys about the course. So, there's about, like, four... So kind of like um sprintish. Well, like f- there's a couple flats, and then there's a couple like sort of hilly, like Capecchi Voss stages. And if Weebs Weebs can get over, um, then that's good. She'll probably win. Weebs is expensive for eighteen, but I do expect she'll get a lot of points. Um, Balsamo for sixteen, like that's good. But um, so there's four, and then there's. Four like um climbish ones. Well, there's two like mountain ones, and then there's two like sort of medium climbs, medium hill stages. Um, there's no TT, so it's a little um disappointing for riders like Christian Faulkner, I think. Yeah. Um, and other TT specialists like um Marlon Rooser, I would avoid her. <clears throat> Mule Muleman for twelve isn't bad value, but I don't think she'll be the leader. Um, yeah, but let's see. Let's start it off with um sprint with sprinter riders. Um, so we have the most expensive, Lorena Weebs. Um, if she costs eighteen, I expect she'll get to around like five hundred to eight hundred points, which is a lot. Um, Elisa Balsamo is a very good pick. She'll probably get second to a few. Um. Marta Cav- uh, oh wait, that's not a sprinter, what am I thinking? Um, Mariana Voss, she can get over those hills, so she's actually a very good pick. I'd say um, 600 to like 800 points, she's good for value. Um, Mavi Garcia, is Mavi Garcia a sprinter? I think she is, I kind of forget. Is pretty good. Um, Lotto Kopecky for 12 is great value, because I feel like her climbing is really uh, underrated and everything. Um... Moving on to the tens for sprinters, not too many. Um, wait, Ochiera Consani is off the start list. It says, I just, uh, yeah, Chiara Consani is off the start list. That's news. She's a pretty good sprinter. Had her on my team. Um, so that's actually surprising. Chiara Consani's out. Any other sprinters? Um, Emma Noisgard. It's good. Um, eight. So clearly, I see Vittoria Guz- Guzani will get some top tens. Nothing special though. I'd prefer going to feel like Anna Hedison or like, um. Wait. I think the entire team of B Pink is out. Oh, B Pink is out. I must have been like COVID or something. Okay, so that's news. Do not pick anyone that's on B Pink. If you have someone, you might want to change them because. You won't really be getting much points. Because they won't be in the race. <laughs> yeah, you won't be getting in any at all. Lip air to the course doesn't suit her too much. But um, Sierra's a pretty good pick. She'll be on domestic duty. Grace Brownfield is a great option. Um, but then again, there's Cavalli. And um, Music and Ludwig all going for a GC spot. So I think she'll just be in breakaways. Great breakaway rider, Cordon Regat, another breakaway. I'd see um, the two EF riders are great. I just don't know who which one they're going for. They're both good climbers. Maybe they're trying to get two in the top ten. Um, Gaspari is good. Oh, yeah, I forgot to say I'm moving on to the GC riders. My bad. Um, yeah, these guys, the two EF riders are good. Grace Brown, too, but she won't be going for that. Anna Henderson breakaway. 
Who else is there? Vita Music. She'll be going for white jersey, but there's no white jersey points. Um, kind of wish there was. So just add in because sometimes the young riders can be a bit overpriced because they only got like a top fifteen and not too many great places. But if they had a white jersey competition, that kind of just add a little bit more into it. Um, Alexander Manley's in it. I just think the or Alexandra, um, Manley's in it. I, I just think the race isn't hard enough. Um, for her to win, um, she'll probably top ten definitely. Um. So, oh wait, no. Oh yeah, yeah. The whole team is that. that that's weird. Maybe Chiro Consorni wasn't on. Here, let me check. Oh no, B Pink isn't just in it. Chiro is just out. The only person she must have just tested positive for COVID. Um, who else? Um, Prisico is a good pick. Same as Roy Jackers. Um. I would avoid picking riders like Cassia Niwondoma and Moolman because I don't think they're going to be too good. Mavi Garcia again. I don't. I forget what she was. Is two um, FDJ riders are good. I just think they'll be going for Cavalli. She'll be looking for a podium, maybe even trying to win. But I don't think that's a bit. I think that's a bit unrealistic. Borghini I think is a bit overpriced for eighteen. Um, I mean, she's good, but she's a bit inconsistent. Um, <clears throat> that's about it. I'll see if there's any six. Oh, yeah. Um, and Sebastian and Amanda Spratt are there. Um, sixes. Who are good sixes? Gutierrez is pretty good. Um, Catherine Sch- um, Schweinberger is good. Yeah, there's not very much for sixes. Um, Nina Beisman is a good breakaway rider. Bugard is good. Um, yeah, that's about it for sixes. Moving on to fours. I don't see too many people that are special in it. Um, Kim Bad is a good rider to take. Um... She'll probably try and get a breakaway, but maybe not. <clears throat> oh, yeah, Yisland is actually pretty good. Um, That's a good pick I would probably take. Um, Let's see who else. I think that's about it. Seven Irad. Maybe Victory Boto. But that's about it for this. This. Um. That's all it is. It's pretty short, but thanks, you guys, for watching. Make sure to leave a like and comment below. Maybe And um, comment below who you are picking on your team. Anyways, check out my other videos. Ciao.